Does God exist? Yes. Why do you say that? I don't know. I my parents grew up were both Catholic. I didn't go to a Catholic school, but I like still believe in God and all of that. But yeah. Can you prove the existence of God? I cannot know. So. So what do you believe in then? I know that's what I got brought up on being as a kid, but like I haven't like fully learned it. But that's just what my parents believe. So. It's, it's what they kind of imprinted on me. What are your thoughts on abortion? It's fine. It's fine to do it? Yeah. Do you think the Catholic faith backs that? No. So then why are you okay with it then? I don't know, was it? So how come you're okay with it then? It's their choice, their body. Like, people make mistakes. Like, it's one way to get rid of it. So. What if I give you another perspective? So if I tell you that it's killing a baby, what are your thoughts on that? Baby, that's not came into this, like, like not born yet, so, like, I don't, it's still a sperm, so. So if a baby is about seven, eight months old, do you reckon it's okay to kill it? No. Nah. Why not? Because it's, like, came into this world, like, it's been born. No, no, I mean, like, still in the womb. In the yep, womb. Yep. I mean, you've already came that far with the baby in the womb, why kill it now? Like, I don't really see a point. So you, you mean you draw a line somewhere? Yeah. So about how many weeks? How many months? To be honest, I would really don't know, but like... This is the reason why I ask. Because a lot of people say, you know, their body, their choice. But I think sometimes people might just be ignorant in the topic, in the subject. And so we like to try and make people a bit more aware about what abortion is actually about. So with abortion, do you know what happens? Uh, to be honest, I don't really know, no. I just know that it goes, it's, it's gone. Well, depending on how big the baby is, what typically happens you know, in an abortion room, and a lot of people testify to this, you can watch some YouTube clips if you like, they would insert a long tool and start to pull out pieces of the baby until they've got every piece, and then they assemble it on the table and once they know they've got every piece, then they put it in a red canister kind of thing and they send it out to the, and to the itinerary or whatever it's called and it gets destroyed. So what are your thoughts? Nah, that's not right. Is that sound inhumane? Yeah. And this happens on a daily basis, but yet everybody says things like, your body, your choice. So what are your thoughts on it now? It was your, like, their choice to get pregnant in the first place. Like, they should keep the baby uh, if it's if they're gonna wait that long like if it's big enough to get pulled out they should just have it like yeah so do you reckon if the baby doesn't have life yet then it's okay to have an abortion yeah how do you know when a baby has life that's a good question when it has a heartbeat yeah they typically have a heartbeat at around four to six weeks yeah, any t I reckon any time before that is like somewhat okay, but as soon as a heartbeat, like as you've gone and done it, you got to live with your actions. Okay, awesome, awesome. So here's my next question. What is a woman? A female. It's got female parts. Um, you're, you're a bigot. You're a misogynist. According to the standards of this world, if you say things like that, that's incorrect. And you just, you I'm, hate. I'm just speaking what I think. I think there's only two genders. Like, I don't really mind if you're like gay, transgender, anything like that. But there's only the two genders, man and woman. What do you say that? That's just my what I think. Like, I don't believe in all of this, like all that other stuff. Like, I don't see a point of it. So th they're pushing this agenda quite vigorously out into the world where they're going into schools and they're teaching our children about you know the multiple different genders probably hundreds by now and transgenders and saying that it's okay to for a man to be a woman a woman to be a man do you think that's okay for people to be teaching that to our children i feel like the transgenders are right like at least give them until like uh, 18 or like 21 fully grown like know what they are and then they can just like decide what they want to be. But like imprinting it on kids at a young age is not okay. Like they they haven't even like grown up, they haven't experienced life. They should be able to experience what they want to experience. 
Who do you reckon should teach them their morals and what they want to believe? Well, for me, my parents taught me, but someone that's a role model in their life or parents or like someone that they look up to.